You know, Ronnie, we got a rematch coming up tonight. Mikhail Kessler versus Carl Frock. You know, Kessler walked away with the win last time. What's your prediction? What do you think might happen tonight? Well, you know what? I mean, I really put it on over because I really don't... I would have had, had a chance to study those guys before. Although I did see them fight, you know, uh, I think it's going to be a good fight. But I think Fox has been a little bit more active. Right. But I think that uh, he may have the advantage because he's been active. Right. Look, he lost, he lost, he lost to Kessler last time. Though. So, you know, Kessler is very confident. This is why I think he's going over to his hometown and, and fighting. Right. So otherwise, if he wasn't that confident, he wouldn't go. Right. So I think it'll be a good fight, and, you know, I think the fans are going to be the winner. Right, right. That's what counts. And right now, would you personally rate Andre Ward the top 168 pounder as well? Absolutely. Actually, I rate Andre Ward as the top pound for pound best fight in the world. I don't think, you know, right. and you can't take it away from Floyd, but right. I think you have to look at who Andre Ward has fought. Right. Look at all the guys he's fought back to back to back to back to back. Right. Nobody in the sport is doing that. Nobody right. is doing that. So why shouldn't he be pound for pound the best fight in the world? That's what pound for pound is supposed to mean. You fight all the best fighters in the world. You fight all the champions, and he did all this. He did that. What right. more can the man do? Right. And I mean, he's not even ranked number two. So right. that's crazy. So whoever is doing this pound for pound ready need to go back and look at the fighters that these guys are fighting, and then you rank them according to the competition. Right. And Ronnie, you should train the amateurs. And Andre Ward, to tell himself as an amateur, he hasn't lost since he's 12 years old. How many people you know haven't lost since 12? No, I mean, I don't know. I don't know anybody. And he won a gold medal. Nobody besides Andre Watts. And he did. He won a gold medal. So, you know, I just let you know that Hardwood, you know, his perseverance is so good that, you know, he's just a good fighter. And it's hard to beat him. So, until somebody beats this guy, he's going to always rank pound for pound in my book.